Color TV Game Japanese, Kara Mu Hepburn, Kara Gemu is a series of five home-dedicated consoles, created by Nintendo and released in Japan only. Nintendo sold 3 million units of the first four models, 1 million units of each of the first two models, Color TV Games 6 and 15, and half a million units of each of the next two models, Block Breaker and Racing 112. The Color TV game series has the highest sales figures of the first generation of video game consoles. The systems can run on C batteries or an AC adapter. History Color TV game 6 The series debuted on June 1, 1977 with the Color TV Game 6 The Color TV Game 6 was jointly developed with Mitsubishi Electronics. It contains six variations of light tennis or pong including tennis, hockey and volleyball, each one can be played in singles or doubles mode. The players control their paddles with dials attached directly to the machine. Additionally, as an alternative to the standard version, a white-colored C battery-powered model of the Color TV Game 6 was introduced. These white-colored consoles had a limited run of only a few hundred units. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Color TV Game 15. On June 8, 1977, just a week after the TV Game 6, Nintendo released the Color TV Game 15 With the two controllers now on cables making for much more comfortable play and 15 slightly different versions of light tennis, the CTG-15 yielded sales of more than 1 million units. Two models of the CTG-15 were released, differing only by a slight color tint change. The Color TV Game 15 included two variations of hockey, volleyball and tennis, and two ping-pong style games. Each game could be played in singles or doubles mode. The extra game was penalty shootout where the object is to shoot the ball past a constantly moving target. Also, the paddle controls were now extended apart from the console, and were wired into it. The console was produced in two shades of orange, the light orange one is much more uncommon. Nintendo sold more than 1 million Color TV Game 15 consoles. It appears as an assist trophy in Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS and Wii U. <laughs> <laughs> Color TV Game Racing 112 On June 8, 1978, Nintendo released the Color TV Game Racing 112 a bird's-eye view racing game that implements a steering wheel and gearshift. Alternatively, two smaller controllers can be used for multiplayer. The gameplay features a car from a bird-eye view driving on a track and avoiding other cars on the road. It is possible to play in two-player mode as well with controls that attach on the back of the console. This was Shigeru Miyamoto's first project working for Nintendo, as he was only a junior employee at the time. 160,000 units were sold. Topic. Color TV Game Block Breaker The Color TV game Block Breaker Kara Terebij Muboraku Bangshi Kara Terebi Jemu Baraku Kuzushi was released on April 23, 1979. The one player console runs a ported version of Block Breaker Baraku Bangshi Baraku Kuzushi, one of Nintendo's arcade games based on Atari's Breakout. Like the Color TV game 6, the in game paddle is controlled by a dial attached to the system and there are switches to play variations of the same game. The system's external design is one of Shigeru Miyamoto's first video game projects after having joined Nintendo in 1977. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Computer TV game. The final console in the series is the computer TV game, Kanpyu Ta Terebij Mu Kanpyuda Terebi Jemu. Released in 1980, it was sold and produced in limited quantities. 
The only game in this console is a port of Nintendo's first video arcade game, Computer Othello. The game can be played head-to-head -head by two people, or against a computer and was quite sophisticated for the time. Nintendo managed to convert it from an arcade game by simply integrating a complete arcade board which made the machine big and heavy. The power supply weighs more than 2 kilograms. The console cost 48,000 yen upon release. Comparatively, the Famicom, which came out only three years later, cost a third of the price and can play hundreds of games. Legacy More than two decades after their release, Nintendo featured color TV games in its WarioWare series. WarioWare, Inc., Mega Microgame Dollar, released for the Game Boy Advance in 2003, includes a microgame version of Color TV Racing 112, as part of 9 Volts' collection of classic Nintendo games. Color TV Game 6 also is a microgame as one of 9 Volt and 18 Volts' Nintendo games in WarioWare, Smooth Moves, released for the Wii in 2006. The Color TV Game 15 appears as an assist trophy in 2014's Super Smash Bros. for Nintendo 3DS and Wii U and reappears in the 2018 sequel Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Topic see also Dedicated console game and watch history of Nintendo Nintendo Entertainment System List of million-selling game consoles.